Yeah, yeah. Rift into universe. hell. Yeah. What this is kind not... of monster are you? <laughs> this is why you need fucking everything with force. What's the bro? Okay, look, Mister. What do you eat spaghetti with? You eat it with a fork. What yeah, do you eat mac and cheese with? Course. But you're missing out. You're eating other things with fork that, that you shouldn't because you haven't okay. had enough fork food. You've never had mac. Never had mac and cheese. Not as an adult. As a kid, I ate a lot of crab oh. dinner, supposedly. Okay, that's a, a little better. So well, I, I mean, like, not not just of this. not just being a kid. I mean, like, before my memory. I have no, like, but, like sentient memory of eating macaroni and you cheese. You need to go have some adult, like, mac and cheese with the breadcrums. I know. I, I mean, I guess I should. Dude, yeah, some adult eat. cheese. At Paxi's, I'm buying you a lobster mac and cheese, and you're gonna fucking love it. I mean, I'll I'll try it. I got nothing against it. It's no, I mean, dope. it's one of those foods that like nobody hates. Yeah, exactly. Like, there's nothing to hate about mac and cheese. Like, what can you hate about? How I really like mac and cheese. I don't like pasta. Pasta. You eat noodles <laughs> all the time. I like pasta. I like uh, you know, I like I like some noodles, but I have a particular taste. I really like like ramen. And soba, but then right. you know sometimes you and and like pho I love, but you get those like Especially sweet potato. Fun. I know, I know. Oh show. <laughs> but you get those like sweet potato noodles that are like clear. It's kind of like vermicelli, but like Asian vermicelli. I'm like I don't want to consume this at all. Like I, I would rather have nothing than have this. You, I need to get you some good pasta. I mean, like, I believe I've you know. had some delicious raviolos. Okay. I've had some uh, fantastic penne's, right? Even some uh, rigatoni that tickled my fancy. Hey. <laughs> I've never really had a. <laughs> so in the th three or four times I've had spaghetti as an adult, I have never been like this. Spaghetti's worth having like more of. Was it like angel hair or what kind of? What are you guys doing? Yeah, was it danger <laughs> hair? I. What about lasagna? You're a lasagna guy. I, I I've like had it. it. I don't really like it that much. It's not that good. Yeah, I'm glad someone else. Okay, did. you're insane. Though, well, now I've got to rethink things because I'm it's with Austin here. Austin yeah, eating strawberries twice in his whole fucking life. <laughs> it's probably like the the third most popular fruit. You've eaten it twice in your life. <laughs> Is it really that popular? Uh, yeah, strawberries. Like I've had the, it's the texture weirds me out. Like it tastes great. But... Like apples okay. and bananas are more commonly Bananas. consumed. Going back, here's the thing that I will say about lasagna. Okay? I And I've had this discussion with Austin before, actually. The thing about lasagna is, it's really easy to fuck up lasagna. Okay. So I can yep. see how you maybe had a not great lasagna. Burned edges ruin it. It, well, I mean, there's there's lots of things. I mean, you could, you could fuck up, There's you could put too much ricotta in there, you could... Uh, uh, actually, put, it's like, ricotta. Yeah, sorry, apologies. Hey, put some fucking mozzarella on top of the day! Hey! Um, I'm really just tripped out about how he's never had mac and cheese, to be honest. I'm still thinking about it myself. The thing is, like, you're never forced into eating mac and cheese. And I think that's the thing. It like, just exists in the air and but, it gets in your wow. mouth and it's good. <laughs> Madrinas. Thanks for the subscription. Oh, I yeah, live! Like Madrinas. Actual Madrinas. <laughs> like twitch.tv slash Madrinas, yeah. Like a funky cool <laughs> Madrinas. Oh, like a funky cool Madrinas. Probably like four years ago, five years ago, I had barely consumed any pasta in my adult life. But then, you know, you go to some fancy restaurants and you're like, well, I didn't realize until I got here that like all they got is pasta. So I've consumed some pastas and I've been like, this is pretty good. This is okay. This pasta is a little weird. I'm trying to lampshade it, I guess. Oh, okay. But uh, mac and cheese is different because they're always like, do you want fries or do you want to pay like an extra four bucks and go up to the mac and cheese? And I'm like, I'm not paying for a new experience that I don't know if I'm gonna like. That seems ridiculous to me. Well, that's why you gotta get, that's why you gotta get like a mac and cheese as a meal. Cause very much like poutine, there are various mm. variations on mac and cheese that but, make it its own self-contained meal. But then and if I order it- Variations. Bacon mac and cheese, wow. uh, lobster I know, mac and cheese. I know the variety favorite. of macs and or cheeses, but- That's what I'm saying. If you- the problem is if I if I get it as an entree and I don't like it, that's like the whole meal down the drain. Mm, but how you're not gonna not do you like, like it. Yeah, do you like cheese? Do you I'm like cheese. I'm very pro cheese. Yes. Then you'll love if, it. You will actually it. love it. But yeah, what? Mostly that's, cheese. That's only half of it, though. What about how I feel about Mac? 
you'll like the Mac really the is Mac secondary. Is, yeah. Even though it's the first part of the name, oh that's God. a lie. All the right. cheese is the primary source of, of desire in the Mac and or that, cheese. Like, that when you bake it just right, you get the breadcrumb layer and with the cheese. Oh yeah. Like, little like, tomato slices on, there, on top. So tomato good. slices on top. Okay, now you that's now you've ruined it. When you <laughs> cut up the hot dogs to look like little baby octopuses and you put them in there. <laughs> I mean, that sounds fantastic. I'm pro No, oh, they're just tomato slices. Why do you gotta ruin everything with tomatoes? Not you specifically, but everyone has to ruin everything with tomatoes. You have a good spaghetti, oh, throw tomato chunks on it's there. It's got just a little tang. All right, I don't know why you don't like tomato chunks. I don't I like tomatoes in anything, I'm, all right? I'm I want you to I'm mush those fucking tomatoes till I don't even know they're in there anymore. Actually, that's, that's... a little tang. That's kind of how I feel about, like, chili. I'm like, I don't really like tomatoes. I'll put, like, four cans of tomatoes in the chili, and then I'm like, this isn't tomato anymore this is chili yeah i've turned I, the tomatoes into a transformative good if there's chunks of tomatoes in anything you have failed in your goal to make tomatoes edible there's yeah. a reason no one's out Salsa? there fucking like eating a tomato whole this is gross <laughs> there's always if you took a group of like 30 people one person would be like yeah my favorite fruit's tomato and that's the person you gotta watch <laughs> out for <laughs> that's the italian in the room so you trying to say racist <laughs> Whoa. I eat lemons. Ooh, ooh, ow. Yeah, Nick is the lemons. lemon eater, and I don't trust that either. I love lemon wedges. They're so good. Why is the NLSS like, like, always about them? food? Because none of us eat ever. <laughs> That's I mean, true, Ryan, actually. We uh, talk about what we can't have. Hands up if you've eaten today. I mean, I can't uh, see, because... I had a bacon Hot Pocket. Does that count? Oh, you yes, know what? That, I did, actually. <laughs> I, ate, I ate a potato knish at, uh, like, 5 a.m. <laughs> what is a potato knish? Never had a Kanish? Oh my it's god, Kanishes are so good! Kanishes are dope. Like, I fucking are hate New York, man. <laughs> <laughs> I had it's a potato Kanish at 5 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Kanishes are amazing. What is a Kanish, though? It's. Uh, I didn't ask so... for sass, okay? I asked for a description <laughs> of what it is. It's, uh, think of it as like a, like a pasty-like deal. Oh, uh, what is a pasty? <laughs> Dough. But, it's dough with wow. mashed potatoes inside of it. Yeah, it's, it's dough something you're saying all these words wrong. What bad terror? A pasty is, uh, is the, you know, the, <laughs> the British form Isn't of that a... is called a pasty? Like a, like a pasty. No, that's what you put on your nipples <laughs> if you're trying to hide it. Well, I think it might be both, right? No, they say pasty. Pasties are crusty and, like, kind of <clears throat> more savory. This is just, like, it's doughy. Okay. Yeah, it is, it is, it is a little bit more. It's good. like the like a gnocchi kind of texture. Can we just a little bit yeah. <laughs> talk about foods that have names that we can all agree on pronunciations? <laughs> there aren't any. Yeah, that's true. Does anyone say tomato? Does anybody ever? Only I, I would say probably ninety nine percent of the pronunciation of tomato is in that expression. Oops. <laughs> I thought British people said tomato, no? Yeah, but they don't count in this case. Tomato. Because that's just how they say <laughs> words. Yeah, that's just the dialect. Right? You don't go, oh, you, you say tomato, it. I say tomato. You go, you say tomato, <laughs> I say tomato, right? Like, the, the the we're clearly comparing two people from North America in that case. <laughs> if you wanted, if you wanted to change it to, you know, you say tomato, I say tomato, then I'd accept it. Let's call the whole thing off. You can't mix <laughs> accents halfway through, though. That said, you guys should have a Kanish if you never had them. They're real good. I don't know. What, what is, is a Kanish? <laughs> what's your... I spell this. It's like K-H-N-I-J-U-S-H. That's K and Nish. That's it. That's it. What is a fucking Kanish, though? Like, uh, you know, it's, it's like a pasty, you know, it's like a Noki, um... It's like it's a Nokia phone. It's, uh, oh you know... <laughs> You do broccoli or you do spinach on the inside. You could do just plain with some pepper. You do that, yeah. There's meat versions too, but potatoes. But what is, like is it? <laughs> it's a fucking. It's a do okay. It's, it's a, a dome made of dough pastry. filled with it's mashed a, potatoes. So yeah, it's, it's a pierogi. Pastry with mashed potatoes. <laughs> but no, but it's big. It's not. It's a big like, pierogi. It's the size of your fist. But it's not a per like. It's it's a flaky crust. It's like a it's a what? crusty kind of thing. Yeah. It's kind of doughy, oh, though. So you don't eat it with your hands, then, because holy shit. You no, you do flakes. eat it with your hands. I ain't no, you, you don't hands, eat it with so. your hands. Well, actually, I didn't eat it with oh, my hands. Yeah. <laughs> you don't eat it with your hands. This is a knife and fork affair. It is probably a knife. Yeah, really? it's true. You can eat it with your hands, but you like... Sound, it sounds like yeah. a Hot Pocket. It's, it's kind it's of a not, Hot Pocket. It's a Knot Pocket. Do you yeah. ever get a, a ganish with a side of Noki <laughs> and then dip it in some Baba Ganoush? 
<laughs> I've never tried. No, that's, that's three different cultural foods. Yeah, what's the problem? You live in New York. If you go to like one of those fusion places, there actually is like a um, a local place near me that does Asian wow. Jewish fusion, which is um, interesting. <laughs> you guys have the. Uh... You don't, but what are they called? Uh, kolaches. Oh yeah, kolaches. the the Greek. Uh, it's like a grape leaf. Is that when you shoot coffee up your ass? <laughs> it's like a pig in a blanket for breakfast. What? Oh, that's. I, I thought it was like. Oh my god. I Why can't you have that for breakfast normally? I thought pigs in a blanket were a breakfast food. Well, no, I mean, they're, they're an hors d'oeuvre. Breakfast food. Yeah, they're. You put like uh, jalapenos in them sometimes. They can have sausage. Horse divorce. Can have ham. What's the that's one that's interesting? It's wrapped. It's like a Greek spiced meat that's wrapped in grape leaves. It's not, I don't know if it's Greek. No, this, this, of a, this is different. But you're thinking of like like kofta? Is that what you're thinking? Oh, of? it might be kofta. Friends, kofta. It might be, be kofta esque. <laughs> <laughs> Domades. That's it. It's domades. Domates. That sounds. Is that good. the stuffed grape leaves? I don't know what we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, that's anymore. the stuffed grape leaves. Do oh, stuffed grape leaves are I dope. I can't handle those. Yeah, yeah, I like them. That's not exactly a pancake. It's it's puff pastry, right? In a oh. on a, uh, <laughs> on a pancake on a pigs in a blanket. It's like puff pastry, isn't it? No, it's like it's, a it, crescent it's a roll, pastry. like a croissant. Yeah, it's a crescent roll. That's actually. Oh, it's a crescent. It's right, not okay. a croissant. Is like I know that a cres crescent roll is based on a croissant. It's a crescent roll. Mm. A croissant is like flaky. A crescent roll is like here's a spiral of dough. Go to Shipley's. You go. You go. Oh give me my two god! <laughs> you get like a give me wow. two donuts and a kolache. You know, really, you actually, wow. you know, if you're a reasonable person, you get two kolaches and a donut. But <laughs> yeah. I feel like I live in another country than you guys sometimes. Actually, there's a the the place that I ordered the kanish from also has this thing called a kaplach. <laughs> Which kind of sounds like some uh, like like Klingon food. Yeah, you're I'm making excited up to words, try. I think at this point. Yeah, Kepler. sounds very Yiddish. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's it's a Jewish deli is where I'm. Where, where yeah, I'm from. no, I figured. Yeah. I was just saying. Yeah, it's good. They had good pastrami, dude. Dope. You love pastrami, man. You like go oh. out of your way. How could you not? It's amazing. Yeah, exactly. It's fantastic. Oh, Domo. Oh, Domo, Domo okay. <laughs> oh my. He tried God. to get up on the desk That's and then it. I went to pet him and he fell over. Oh, Tomo. <laughs> That's very silly. He's what very fuzzy, though. Guy. He'll be okay. Yeah, Does he got... like uh, Kinnish's? Oh. oh, fuck me. He Why am I what here? He likes, to be honest. <laughs> I'm still. I'm no! Still, like, on you not fucking having fucking mac and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of world is this? Well, I just, like, I've <laughs> never found an opportunity in which I was forced to eat mac and cheese. Why do you need to be forced? It's delicious. Well, because, like,. Otherwise, it's not like the other alternatives are bad. Like from a side perspective, you're like, I can either have you know fries, <laughs> which are delicious, <laughs> sweet potato fries, which are usually delicious, mashed potatoes are delicious. Yeah, it's like I'm not incentivized to get the mac and cheese. You ever like get it as like even like as a shitty side dish from KFC? It's really good. No, but at KFC. Yeah. You gotta get the All gravy, right. man. You gotta get something well, you can that... Get both. Well, they're not no. gonna give you just gravy as a side dish. We're no, but I mean, like, you can't dip the mac and cheese in gravy. I mean, you could. Oh. It would be awful, though. Eh, I mean... Just dump a shitload of gravy on it. Mac and cheese doesn't have to be a side, but yes, then if I take it as an entree, it's more risk. Why don't you just make some homemade mac and cheese instead, then? You That's not how you do something for the first Even time. Risk. You don't make it at home for yourself, because then I got no baseline. Yeah, but it's like, it's hard to find a place that is just like, oh, oh we do great mac and cheese. You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't know if you're going to find that in Vancouver. You know what I mean? Vancouver. You have to go out of your way to get to a place that's going to be like a great mac and cheese store. You you know nothing, Robert. <laughs> no. Do they have great mac and cheese stores? We got great everything. It's so It's a world-renowned city from a culinary standpoint. I mean, I believe that, but I'm just saying. Like you know, if you're gonna go, you're gonna go out specifically get mac and cheese. You can just make it, just make a make a roux, and then put some cheese in it. You're good to go. What is what is he Australian now? What is he Michael A. L. Fox? <laughs> <laughs> you know you know how to make a roux, right? I know how to make a roux, of course. Well, I was like, hey, all the time. Of I've course, never, Ryan can. 
I've never tried this before. What's the best first way to try it? Well, you know, just mix uh, flour and butter in a pan and then, you know, reduce it, add water until, you know, there's no chunks in it. And then just uh, pour some cheese in it, boil some macaroni on the side and mix them together. That's not the way you introduce a food to somebody. Why not? Because you, you have no baseline. You can taste it, you're going to be like, no matter what, you're going to be like, this is a 6 out of 10. As long as it's oh. not poison, you're going to be like, this is a 6. Because you don't know base. what an 8 is, you don't know what a 4 uh, is. I certainly do know what an 8 is. I feel like it's right an oppressive childhood when it comes to food. Oh, That's not really true, I was just a picky eater, by design. I'm dead. I didn't weird. even like fish when I was a kid. No, yeah, I had to a, eat it. There's a lot of adults I'm with you on who that. don't like fish. Wait, Rob, you don't eat fish? No, 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 I, I do. Okay. I, I, like, I eat, I but eat, you were, like, disappointed kid, when you said it. No, no, when I was a kid. Well, the thing is, like, I'm not a huge, like, fish guy even now. Like, I like fish sometimes, but, like, not all the time. But I wish I was super into fish because there's so many different varieties. When there's you people know? who are like, I don't like seafood, I get it. You know, you eat an oyster, that's, like, a whole, a whole organism. Like, you got its colon in there, you got, like, its yeah. fucking heart, and, like, it's, it's a little weird, right? I get it. Yeah. When people are like, I don't like fish. And you're like, why? Oh, it's just a little too fishy for me. I'm like, you gotta <laughs> get over that. <laughs> you gotta, like, at least try to consume some fish, like, once a year until you get past that. Yeah. I might have had bad fish, too. Like, there's some oh really oily, God. greasy fish that just doesn't taste as good as, like, a proper, well-cooked fish. Yeah. But where are you going true. to get this trash fish? I don't know. It just happens. Sometimes trash fish happens. Funny fish story, uh... My, yeah, funny uh, fish. I'm very eager to hear this funny it's fish story, funny fish to be story. honest. I want to hear a funny fish story. Well, I was a, I funny was fish a story, by the way. <laughs> little brat when I was like six or seven or eight years old. I don't remember how old I was, but uh, I was I was at a place with uh, with my family and my friend's family, and uh, I guess their no! mother decided to play a little a little fish prank hashtag Ooh. fish prank on me. And Fishy she fish. was like, "I'm gonna. What do you want?" And I'm like, "I don't know. I just don't want the fish." Because and it was a fish based place, so. That was kind of right. complicated. Yeah. She's also like, okay, I'll already use some some chicken run. some chicken tenders, all right? And I was like, oh, thank you, appreciate that. And so I started eating it. We got the got the chicken tenders, and uh, she just has this fucking smile on her face. She's laughing. She thinks it's chicken. It. She had ordered me fish. Uh, and the the funny part of it is that I wasn't like, oh wow, what a surprise. This is uh, this is some good stuff. I guess I do like fish. No, I was like, you bitch. You <laughs> <laughs> and I hated her for so long just for That's that. That's so oh my good. God. Did you yeah. like the fish? The fish was great. I love it now. I, I <laughs> owe it to her for helping me to get into the fish market. I was I very the angry. The story was that you, you were spoiled on fish for life after that day. <laughs> yeah, me too, yeah. Oh, you're dying. Or are you dying? Not only do you hate her, but you also will never eat fish again. <laughs> I'm a big salmon <laughs> guy. You guys like salmon? Yeah, yeah I love yeah. salmon. Man. Extremely yeah. pro salmon. Yeah. Salmon's dope. I know some grouper. people don't like salmon. Yeah, I've had some grouper. It's, it's, it's enjoyable. I've probably consumed grouper, but I don't think I would know it if I saw it. It's like, this, they usually give you like a really big fat fillet of that if you're gonna have mm. a fillet. Yeah. It's a real fat. Tilapia. Mm. I'm not a big tilapia guy. Tilapia actually. is like the... This is where I get confused because I've had a lot of fish and people are like, I don't like this specific fish, but a lot of times it's very similar. It's all to do with the texture. Some of it is similar, yeah. What uh, is your favorite fish? I think mine's Well, salmon. you know, it depends on the context. Salmon, yeah. For, a, for okay. a fish and chips, it's all about paying the extra three fifty and getting halibut instead of haddock or, or cod. You get just that, for the halibut, yeah. It's, it's like a little fattier, but it's also firmer. And then if you really like don't care about the environment or the well-being of species other than human beings, Chilean sea bass is like exquisite. There's like 15 of them left on planet Earth, so <laughs> if you somehow find out that you have one on your plate, you might as well enjoy it at that point. It's not like you're putting it back it's in the ocean. The now. Yeah. yeah. But from like a tuna, or from a, from a sushi standpoint, I'm a tuna man, but I also enjoy the salmon as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm a spicy just not getting guy. into sushi. I was oh. out of the sushi train my whole life, and I just, it sucks living in like, the middle of Texas. You can't get, like, good sushi. Yeah. Do you guys even have fish over there? Yeah, it's Does just like, exist? you know, they gotta, like, freeze it and transport it or well, shit. You got, like, like the Gulf of Mexico, right? Uh, <sighs> not anymore, really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they've lost the Gulf of Mexico. No, anymore. it's like. Not very good for you, mostly. Can you still eat fish uh, out of the Gulf true. of Mexico since the I'd, BP I'd, thing? 
I thought it wasn't like yeah. a great idea to. No, they yeah, tried to make a fine. PR campaign saying it was fine, but it like kind of isn't fine, is my understanding of it. But they do really? that like they're like, well, since the Fukushima disaster, we tested uh, Pacific salmon and we found radiation in it. And then everyone posts it on Facebook like, oh my god, our kids are gonna have twelve nipples. And you look at the actual <laughs> scientific paper, and it's like one one millionth of a daily like recommended allotment of radiation like I, there's probably no recommended allotment of radiation but it's like eating <laughs> eating recommended you need, you need a little bit of radiation in your life you know eating the Everybody pacific needs salmon a little radiation it gives you like as much uh I'm an idiot. you know radiation <laughs> as like smelling an airplane or something like that and you're like okay I'll take the I'll take the salmon, please. Bananas you know? have like radiation, don't they? But that everything has a little yeah, radiation. Has a no, little but bananas radiation. specifically have like more radiation than That's other. That's a banono. When the extrude appears, oh god! I worked toward the extrude. The extrude for you. Oh, but I. Wait, shit. you didn't. You didn't extrude. I was stuck. I, I got stuck. Oh, I did extrude. First end coin. People that will like, oh, I don't want to get the salmon. I'm worried about radiation. Yeah, so I flew like 1,500 times last oh. year. And like going up in an airplane like doubles your yearly dose of radiation or something like that. Like you get 365 uh, days of atmospheric radiation from going up in an airplane. <laughs> wow. So, so why are we not extruding, Ryan? Because this is cooler now. <laughs> Extrude betrayed me. I thought it was that thing about like when you no! smell you smell fumes in the airplane and you're sure you're all gonna get killed somehow. Oh, that's that's we a type of radiation for sure. That's smell radiation. Oh yeah, yeah that's that's got it. <laughs> Apparently, it's the potassium in, in bananas. That's a big banana. Yeah. It like it's it stores radiation or something. That's, that's I don't know if it stores radiation, but I think it's just radioactive. Just get some Radex. It's all good. Radioactive. Yeah. Planetary. Let's get potassium. It makes my tummy yum. Welcome to the bananas. You know, <laughs> Imagine Dragons. You... Was, was, was that like a spooky banana? Is a boo banana? Well, those guys were big for like a couple years. It might still be the biggest act in the world. I have Fuck no idea. my ass, dude. My um, ass, dude. I'm gonna decline, but you know, to each their own. Ba -da -ba 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 -da. Who's the biggest ba -da -ba 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 -ba. current band in the United States of America? Probably that fucking uh, Kanye. Yeah. The duo group. The they duo group. group. Twenty one pilots, maybe. Twenty one pilots. They do the stressed out song. Yeah, they're yeah. Like, literally never heard of them. Yeah. Wow, I'm out never of touch. Heard of them? They like came out of nowhere. Yeah, they came out of somewhere. People always say that, and then you look at their biography, and it's like, well, they spent like. 14 years playing like shitty bars in Cincinnati and Dayton. Right, yeah. and they, <laughs> they had like one hit and then everyone just like, wow, they were, where did they go? Where did they come from, Cotton Eye Aww. Joe? Great song. Oh, farts. Uh, well, that's fine. People are saying 21 Pilots, they're terrible. It's like, that wasn't the question. It was who's the most popular. Who's the biggest? Yeah, I mean, I lived through the Kings of Leon era, you know? I understand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what was this song like? Sex on fire or something? Oh, they they had sex oh, on fire. Cause it's sex on fire. Sex. And they had, sex on fire. That's like, it. And then they also had, you know, I'm gonna use somebody. Why are they gonna use somebody? That's Cause their sex up. is on fire. They need something to extinguish the blaze. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah. They're gonna use a person. Well, they get they're gonna water? use someone like you. Just oh, snuff it with oh. some muff. <laughs> you yeah, just, you're just... supposed to pour mayonnaise on it, so it extinguishes the grease fire. You still can. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the weekend is pretty big? I'm glad to hear that, because he's Canadian, so... Vampire weekend or the regular one? I mean, probably both is of them, vampire but... Vampire weekend? I don't think there vampire... Was. I don't How do you live in New York? Uh, I'm a well-cultured uh, New York socialite. Oh, vampire weekend? Never heard of them. I'm not a I'm not a big music guy, honestly. I don't really follow. He's a socialite, though. Music, yeah, that's true. I am a socialite. They're both. I big, leave though. the house a lot of times, all the time. You're talking about Mr. Weekend. Yeah, Senor Weekend. Senor Weekend. Everybody, yes. Senor for the weekend. That's my vampire weekend? weekend. That's my lover boy, who are Canadian American. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. They are Canadian American, but where the hell is Lover Boy from? I'm gonna say. Venezuela. They're like a Calgary band. They're like Venezuela. Alberta. Venezuela. Come on, Nick. <laughs> Don't be jealous just because we got all the... We got half of all the 80s rock bands. Oh, Calgary, Alberta! Uh, he did it! <laughs> that really? is right, I did it! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Have you ever been so Canadian you can guess the city a band is from just from their songs? 
How old does that make like, you? Know? Ridiculous, though. Like if you hear Nos, you're like, the you know, it's called New York Energy State drink? of Mind. Yeah, I wonder where that forward. guy's from, right? Yeah. Loverboy just has a similar vibe of like wanting to get out of a hellhole, so I was like, it must be the prairies. Nick, why are you going that way? You're gonna die. Why are you going that way? You're gonna die. I'm gonna get the coin and go the oh other way. Oh my god. <laughs> you gonna get out of there? So much. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Austin, do you know in Hitman level 2 they give you six coins? Wow. Nick, why are you going that way? <laughs> You're just jealous. I mean... Okay. Oh uh, yeah, he's done it. He's, uh, he's... I have done it. Whoa! <laughs> it has been done! I was out of the fire and went back in. That's true. You guys should actually like play Hitman so I have more people on my friends list. Every time I beat a mission, it's just me, except like mission one and two had Mathis. <laughs> I should have been on one. Both. I did the ship. Yeah, th that's just the tutorial. I killed nearly everyone on the entire <laughs> ship, so I think I'm the hittest man. Honestly, that there is. you know, you're not gonna like this, but that gives you zero points. What? <laughs> you, you lose you lose 5,000 points for every non-target you I kill. sat in the goddamn parking lot for like an hour shooting all the civilians. <laughs> and you're telling me I got no points? <laughs> you got a lot of like intrinsic value though. I like, hit so many men! I love when Ryan got into the whole freaking crazy idea of how the actors had to be in that training level. Like they Think literally just get killed. They had to commit so much to their role of not knowing who the hitman was that they had to forfeit their own lives. <laughs> That's the thing, it's like, they, they hire you for this job and they're like, hey, like, this guy is gonna come around murdering people and he might murder you. But you have to pretend you don't know who he is unless he does, like, these very specific fuck-ups that you pay attention for. <laughs> and don't be scared as he's about to murder you, just go with it. So you, like, look at him and be like, wait a minute. Okay, he's wearing a tuxedo. Is that the tuxedo of the other dude I know at this party who's supposed to be wearing this tuxedo? <laughs> if so, then get suspicious. Oh, there's only one bird there. That's sad. You seen birds what? again, Austin? Birds? <laughs> birds, man. He has fake bullets? I don't think he has fake bullets. Like He used a grot wire around his neck. <laughs> grot wire. That sounds like a, like a dog. Yep. It's really a bad <laughs> joke, yeah. I know, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, I like to go with that, yeah. Sounds like a Really should have thought about that one. <laughs> Stick with it? big old dick when you don't know what wow. to finish the sentence with. Yeah, I know. I oh, know. Um, no. Fuck. 10 out of 10 joke. <laughs> Sounds like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, on the upside, it's going to be a meme now, so congrats. Yeah, that's true. Did you guys see? I'm so amazed. Somebody what? posted, like, you know, the horse meme from Monday's show. They found a picture of Dan from Big Brother in a <laughs> horse costume. <laughs> I'm like, how did, like, the meme is a, like a Celtic knot that folds back in on itself. It's a Mobius knot. Who could have known, you know, six years no ago one. on Big Brother 10 that that picture would be so relevant? <laughs> it's not destiny, it's Danstony. Oh. 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 Are we still alive? No, we are not. Wait, were you booing what I said or something else? No, the level no, changed. It's... Oh. Life. Oh my god. Thank you, Versmensch69, for the subscription. What? Ah! It delayed? Ah! Why did that shooter go so late? What a bingus. Can we get some uh, dogs in chat? <laughs> <laughs> I got some dogs. Kinda sounds like a dog. Dog. Post post my dogs in chat. Post his dogs in chat. Post his frogs in chat instead. Do we get some OS frogs in chat, please? Ryan. Did you know Canadian money has meat in it? Oh, that was like the clickbait article from yesterday, what? right? Like some money's now being made with animal tallow. What? Why? I don't know. It's probably I mean they probably have better reasons for it than we would think. They're not just gonna be like. Even meat being in it like a pierogi. But it, oh, I got super punch. Well, like you know, there's that old Native American proverb, right? That's <laughs> like, what am I thinking? <laughs> That's like you That's know only Canadian proverb. What am only I thinking? Only when there's no uh, <laughs> buffalo left will they learn that you can't eat money. Suck on that shit. We got gotcha. you. You ever see those uh, old like prospectors? They would bite a coin all the time. It's not that they were checking to see if it was authentic metal. It was to see if there's meat inside the coin. Yeah, They're just hungry. Gosh, chickens. <laughs> yeah, that guy. 
We have an old prospect of peaches and gravy. <laughs> oh, oh, what am I thinking again? Rob loves Gus Chickens. We used Gus to talk about him all the time. Amazing. It's like top notch stuff, man. Oh, picker shoes. Oh no. I like how the wave deposits you. <laughs> yeah, but I wonder what <laughs> this it is meant not though. Safe. Oh, oh, you are a dingus, Mr. You should look up uh, Gus Chickens. Yeah, sure. We know who that is. Mind so, if I roll meat? Sounds like some kind of dog. <laughs> you will never get this. Whatever. Whatever. I don't even need it. Which one are you going for? Which one are you going for? The easy one. Ah! Oh! oh! I jumped right to the sob. We give to the Fuck man who is everything. Camera. Oh Two more coins. No, wait, way longer this time. Apologies, all the cameras in chat. So we know as long as the the, the worst thing is getting Nikita, that's the worst situation. Nikita Kucharan, you got. Oh, I missed. On. Okay. Oh God. <laughs> Rob, you're a little bitch. <laughs> yeah, I, you say that, but I finished the level and neither of you did. So yeah. doesn't mean no. Finishing the level is meaningless here, man. Yeah, we're in sixty uh, episodes. Is it though? Finishing the level matters. It's not about so. the level. <laughs> Ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. How do you level it? Why did I do this? It's all right. Ooh, Ooh, yep, how do we all dodge those? I feel like none of us are actually timing it out. Oh no! Oh boy. Okay. Which, which one are you going for? I'm going for the far one. The easy one. The far lands? No. Oh, it's not as easy as it used to be. Oh, I had two I coins. Go there. I gotta go this way. J. Martin, thank you for the seven, seven months in a row. Remember when With I the had water still cold. there? <laughs> You'll never get this. You just forget to look. Oh my oh god! My god <laughs> oh, I wonder what the wave meant. I think it meant that I'm going back for the coins after the wave you goes better. away. better. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, that's, oh no. Oh. What? Oh no, don't punch me. It punched me so hard! The coin is still there, why did oh, I- Oh no! Nikita always- oh, my body! Nikita why am I a dumb yeah, asshole idiot, on. man? Peaches and gravy. Ooh, he's bombing a porter. Oh, I would you... like to go through the porter, I please! Really, I really also would like to go through the teleporter. You may not. Oh, he didn't jump! Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. Nick, you you got those, but will you get the other two? That's the question. I'll get them off your cold dead body. No, the wave's coming. There's not enough time. Nikita! No! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're dead. Yeah, you're I'm not doing going that. Behind. That's gonna be Oh, come on. Oh, wow. <laughs> God. Fucking you got him. Hey, I don't oh, know. I got to... Sixteen hundred dollars, and who wants to be a millionaire? That seems pretty good for a day's work. I'll just, uh, <laughs> I'll just go home now. Ooh, but you got three lifelines left. Yeah, it's so I just, I just want to go home. Sixteen hundred dollars is nothing to sneeze at, man. It is on who wants to be a millionaire. That's way below expected EV, dog. Uh, that's. Yeah, I, I would can, like to go and change those now. Totally no! be happy with sixteen hundred dollars. That's not bad at all. I mean, I'd be yeah. happy with it versus zero, but not if I had the chance to win one oh, million dollars. Oh, that's why you died. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> yeah, what enter about, the uh, gungeon of dead bodies bouncing. What it. about the tournament that you're doing? Like, if you got to like, you know, if you got into like the 10k bracket, and you, you know, if you proceed, you can get up to 30k. Would you do it? Well, you. But you got a best crossy road against Cobalt Streak. Yeah. You have to proceed. Like. No, no but, well, it, but I'm, I'm imagine the hypothetical where yeah. you like. You either decide to go home with the money, or you keep going. Right, but here's the thing. $1,600 is like 0.1% of a million, almost. <laughs> Whereas, like, you know, $10,000 is more than 0.1% of the grand prize. I want to go on the teleport. Ah, oh, I made it Why did my jump get cancelled? Oh, my God. I love it. Love it. Did you say Lubbock? Isn't that in Germany? No, it's Texas. Ah, yes, yeah, it's in Same thing. Texas. You're thinking of Lubeck. Yeah. No, that's <laughs> right, yeah, Lubeck, yes. Ah! You're dead. I'm not dead! Okay, I am. Alright. <laughs> oh, I got warped through the wall. Robert. 
What? You got a problem? You can do better, man. <laughs> I'm not going back for those coins. I'm letting you guys die to them, and then I'll, I'll go take them. Take them afterwards! You take them if you don't even know how to get them in the first place. I don't need to get them in the first place. You guys go get them for me. I'm not going to bring them to you. I'm going to die where <laughs> I, mean, I got them. You did, well, exactly. And I'll go get them there. You live by the coin, you die by the coin. Exactly. Look at this! Look at this Joker! Took away your first points, you Joker! Bitch. He said Robert! And he went and he got it, he completed the level without getting any coins! Well, you don't know that. He could die <laughs> and then, like, be right at the exit so that the coins get inherited by me. <laughs> that's how we do it. That's how This is how we do it. Ba -da -da -ba -ba -ya -ya -ya. That's the sneakiest song. way to get coins, inherit them. This is how we do Dude, it. Dude, Kay was watching this video last night and it was like the top 15 like weirdest cultural things about Japan, right? And uh -huh. it was pretty standard, pretty like right. tame stuff that was like, hey, they work a lot. And you're like, yeah, okay, that's true. Hey, you know, they got a lot of vending machines. And you're like, yeah, definitely. And then like, number two is like, you know, they eat a lot of fish. You know, that's normal. Number one, ritualistically disemboweling yourself as a sign of great personal shame. <laughs> what the fuck, man? You really took it to the next level with the uh, seppuku at number one there. All the coins are gone. <laughs> Nick, I just got them. I thought you didn't. What's the name of that dish where they cut open a living fish and you eat it still beating heart? That's what we call that the number one. Yeah, I've never one of the seen... nice things about seppuku is if you're someone who's in a, per a privileged position, they would have someone cut off your head so you don't suffer for very long. Yeah, That's which true. I think is just kind of like gesture of good faith. You know, koyotu. You, is that you what it's cared called? enough? Yeah, koyotu. That's how you pronounce it. Mm. Cared enough to pull your intestines out and fall over, so you might as well be beheaded. That's nice of them. I'm gonna assume it's not true, because it's Rob Spouts bullshit all the time. No, really, look it up. It's, uh, I don't know what it's called. I, if it's if it's Totoyu, like someone in chat said, but... Uh, uh Toyota Tacoma? That's, that's racist. Honestly. That's not racist at all, it's just a reliable <laughs> automobile. <laughs> if talking about reliable automobiles is racist now, I guess you gotta take me to jail. <laughs> tile. God damn it. Tile. You know what? I'm holding B. Toyota Dial. Enjoy, enjoy Holding beef on this? That's like, <laughs> that's tiles. like not, that's a, like abstaining from the fastest finger on who wants to be a millionaire. You're that's like, exactly I don't even want to try. <laughs> no, you gotta win shit. up on that stick like I did. That's the cool way to win. Win up on the stick. Something like this? Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh didn't get there. You know what you gotta do with the, the two exactly tile. What I gotta do Rob, we gotta make a... Uh, yeah. We gotta make a semi-permeable. No, you that makes it one tile, Robert! Rob! Rob! I know. That's we... on purpose. You can't now we're gonna make it go over the glass. No, now I'm gonna no. block it so you like just can't make yeah. it up. Yep, me too. I'm gonna waste an Akita doing <laughs> it too. You can't turn a two tile into one tile. You threw yeah, the, that's, you that's drew heresy. first blood, man. <laughs> it's gonna take too much. It's gonna take right. too much! Wait, Ryan, you didn't get- Oh, you can only get rid of one. Yeah, I only got dynamite! What? No, oh, the nukes are precious, man! Oh, okay, that's okay, okay. That's like- That's still, that's still pretty That's tough. like two tiles diagonally or something. I'm okay with it. This is gonna be a hard one. Punch. Oh, I punched the way for Nick. Punch. Yeah. Oh, and he punched the way for me! Punch. No oh, 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 oh. No, oh, I didn't no win up on the stick. No yeah. I gotta win up on the stick. Right, that's why you gotta be so rude. You gotta be so yeah. Oh, there you those, go. those guys are Canadian as well. Are they? I want them to be. What's their? What's their? Like, where's the news? No! Where do you sign up? <laughs> rude song. Is it like cool Canadians that Stop. ca? That's by Punch Magic. Wait for Nick. Rude is the debut single by Canadian band Magic. Wait. God. From their debut studio album, "Don't Kill the Magic." They're from this Toronto, is, Ontario, is, Canada. Oh, oh, good extrude, good extrude. Personally, okay, why? Oh. One of my favorite reggae fusion bands. Okay. I want to, I want to gauge the level of hate for this, this meme that apparently is newer than I thought it was. Okay. 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 Because this, I, there's some deep-seated hatred for this one. Damn, oh, Daniel. Is it? No, 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 no. Pineapple, it, apple pen. It is PPA. -P. Yeah, that, that means yeah, garbage. Yeah, yeah, I've heard it's about a garbage that, meme. Yeah. Well, that's a not People quality. Are... Meme. Absolutely outraged. Oh, I want to build a stick! Wait, how'd you guys make it through? Extreme. Use the boost. Fuck my ass. Use the boost to get through? I was looking at it too, and that, cause, cause I, I found it linked go. to me. And oh. I had no, oh, I had no knowledge of this PPAP. No knowledge at all. And I, I watched it and I was like, this is 
quirky, catchy, and you know what? It was a nice little video. And then I went back and uh, I looked at the comments, and people were like, I, I hate everything about this. This has ruined my life. Uh, this <laughs> is literally taken over my school, and it's the worst thing ever. I was like, okay, it's one of these. Yeah, it's and, a low tier uh, meme. I went and I, I looked at the, the search results underneath the original video. It's, it's literally like just a microcosm of YouTube. If you go look at all the other oh. search results for PPAP, oh. go do it right now. Go no, search I'm not going to do it because I don't care. Yeah, I refuse, no, I'm telling actually. chat to do yeah. it. Go, go look it up. Just go look at all that stuff. Chat, you should refuse. As well. Yeah, refuse. Don't let Austin boss you around. <laughs> okay, that's fair. Does it mean something other than those words? It's a, it's Pineapple like an pen. engineered viral video. Yeah, that's the worst kind. It's catchy. It's like no, being into like, a uh, What's Up frog. It's not catchy. Fucking, you know, that was like the that, that was like I, I felt so betrayed when Jimmy Kimmel made that video of mm. the lady falling over and setting her house on fire because I really yeah that, that one was fine. really good. It was good, but like it's just like man. Oh my god. I was really hoping you she can't. was dead. Is that <laughs> phantom glue or reverse phantom glue? Hold on, I think this is reverse phantom glue. It is. Oh yeah. So for the uninitiated amongst us, what's reverse phantom glue? Is glue that is placed but does not work. Oh my goodness. Oh, Whereas you phantom glue is oh, glue that ah, is placed wow. but invisible and does work. Yeah. Aww. Are there any meme owls? Like, uh, yes, actually, of course. Really? Yeah. Yeah, Brian, look no, out. yeah, it's the Aurelia owl. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Is there like a better meme owl, though? Growl it. He's not a meme. Yeah, he's, he's a meme a now. Meme. He's a good meme. He's a cute round owl. Can't just say yeah, he's yeah a good you can't meme. say he's a meme because you like it. Yeah. Well, I mean, I've seen I've seen a couple pictures of Rowlets stacked on top of each other so that they're like infinitely recursive Rowlets. Yeah, I made that. Oh, you made that? Yeah. I saw that That's like posted on form. other people's Twitter. Twitter. Really? <laughs> Twitter. 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 On their Twitters. I mean, probably other people made it too because making long neck Pokemon was Whoa! a really popular idea. Wait, we did, but we I did make it at one point. There was a double cooch there. Wait, oh, the Tootsie Pop owl is a meme too. Yeah. I don't know. If a it's one. A, meme. a two. Is it just, a that, three. That just exists. All jokes are meme now. It's meme memes now. It's 2016. Meme meme meme. It's almost not 2016 though. Yeah. That's thank true. God, right? It might be 2016 again next year. Yeah, I really hope better. that it's not. I hope it Can is. Can we have 2017 just be a 2017? Can it's we like have 2017 be thing? an ice bucket challenge? Ice bucket <laughs> Rip your chat. <laughs> that was a 2015, wasn't it? Yeah. I hate that that's allowed, but the Ocean Man pasta gets timed out. That's just... Oh my I don't have ocean any control pasta. over that, honestly. Can we get uh, Coney back? No. No. So we don't want is he alive? I don't know, probably not. Yeah. Thank you, you Mr. Kreider240 for the five months. Uh, good luck on your 50 nug challenge. I'm of the opinion that if you are not a streamer, you should not do the 50 nug challenge. Yeah. I so there's like roughly six or seven people from my chat alone that have done it, so. I keep getting tweets of people that are like, I bought 80 nugs. I'm gonna eat them all. <laughs> Man, don't do that. <laughs> Yeah, it's a really bad idea. It doesn't feel good. It's That's like it's really your life, bad. whatever you want to do. It's like the jackass yeah. thing, though. You know, it's like you're on jackass. You're gonna like staple your nuts together, then go crazy. Rob you does know? that. You're making mad money, Chris Pontius. That makes sense. But you're just like I'm like a 14 year old kid. I'm gonna staple my nuts to the side of my leg. You just gotta go to the hospital. Like <laughs> you don't get any reward for it. That's a good point. The yeah. reward of a good story. Well, it's not really not a good that, it's story. It's not really that good of a story. If, you, yeah, if I, mean, I met somebody and they're like, hey, like, last night, guess what? I ate 57 Chicken McNuggets. I'd be like, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> Was it, like, for a show or something? You, like... yeah. <laughs> oh, Robert Postmortem, Post baby! Mm -hmm. Some good mm -hmm. ultimate chicken heart. Yeah, there was That's some quality expedited. Memes.